All right, there, everybody. We are here to learn about reading resistor color codes. Um, by the end of this video, you should be able to take and look at a resistor with the uh, four band color code and determine what kind of resistance it has. So, this is a resistor, and when you look at a resistor, you're going to notice that there's these colored bands on it. Um, when you read a resistor, you want to make sure that the tolerance band, which is often a gold or a silver band, sometimes there won't be one here at all, and sometimes you'll have even other colors. You want that to be on the right-hand side of the resistor. We're going to read from the left to the right, just like we would in um, any type of reading that we do. So our first band is what's called a digit band, the second band is a digit band, and the third band is called the multiplier band. Let's go and actually practice one. So to actually do this, what we're going to do here is look at the colored bands that we have. The first colored band is a yellow band. Now yellow, if I look over here on my chart, the first digit corresponds to a 4. The second digit, or the second color here, that looks like violet. And if we use our second digit, violet represents a 7. So we write these two numbers down next to one another. The third band, right here, is a red band. Now the third band is kind of a special band because the third band is what's called our multiplier. So what this means is that since it's red, we multiply by 100. So in the end, I have 47 times 100, and this is in ohms. Ohms are the unit for resistance. And so when I actually do the math here, I'm going to get 4,700 ohms. And this is the resistance of the resistor that I have here. Let's try another one. Here, on this uh, resistor, we have the first color. That looks like a gray. Our second one is red. These are our digits. If we go for gray, gray over on our chart represents 8. Red represents 2, so that's 82. And then our th third one is what's called the multiplier. And again, if I look over here, that's yellow. Yellow is a multiplier of 10,000. So we're going to multiply by 10,000. And of course, my units once again are in ohms, so I'm going to get 820,000 ohms.